Hello then, folks. Seven played. Seven one is Glory Hunter. Doesn't sound like Glory Hunter, does it? Folks, welcome back to Glory Hunter, and in season 19, we finally have what I consider the perfect start. Take a look, then you can see since our victories at the start of the season, two more have been accumulated: a 3-0 win against Leon, and if I'm laughing while saying it because I can't believe it, and a 4-0 win against Montpellier. We look very, very good. Uh, Cagliari as well were beaten in the Europa League as well. So today, though, Nancy and Nice. Now I feel like when you're winning like this and you're on a streak like this, I want to show you more of the streak like this. You can see so far six plays, six wins then in the league Emmanuel uh, doing the business as well and we actually come into this game with a bit of a problem and by the way Keith Budd seven assists so far this season um, in six games so you'd be pleased to know he can't feature today oh no that's right we've got a few concerns whether there be suspensions or injuries and whether we risk a few players that is going to be the question going into this first game then um, we go, obviously Burn with 74% with conditioning has to come out so Akiza comes in that's quite straightforward Ruiz on the right hand side he's, he's going to have to step out as well um, the, this is the problem now I've not I've not done enough in terms of rotation and keeping the full squad we've been winning every game it's very difficult to want to do that in glory hunter so you can't really do that much rotation uh worth noting as well uh fanger has left the team i know you're, you're surprised by it and we've got loads of money still left to spend the strategy viewers and you're gonna love this is i'm going to spend all the money in january that's right players that are available right now aren't very good when players are disenfranchised and transfer listed by bigger teams i'm going to swoop in with my 90 million where other people probably can't and, uh, and bring in some big names to try and get me over the line that is that's the plan uh we've brought in crispin who is a backup right back he's just very much that a a backup right back i can't find a really good first choice right back i need a backup right back so crispin is our guy and uh, hernandez is coming as well center back again doesn't look all that really but he's a slightly well i'd say slightly a much cheaper option of fanga while being very very similar in terms of attributes and what he offers uh speaking of fanga then we've got some money for him 20.5 million off to Lil, that might be deemed a mistake, but I think getting the amount of money that we have for him, it's a transfer that sort of was not, it didn't really work out, if we've been honest. If you're selling him after a year, it hasn't worked out, has it? So that's the situa uh, situation we find ourselves in. Going into this game then, as I say, we've got to do a few little alterations here or there. Um, Patty's going to get his first game. There is definitely a concern here for me in regards to fitness. Lejeune as well has got a slight injury. The, the thing with Lejeune, he turns to, he's got a bruised ankle. You can play with a bruised ankle, mate. You have to. And hopefully we bring in the big dogs next game and we can continue the streak regardless. Hopefully we can continue it right now. We're going to need the likes of Minaz and Emmanuel. You can see some top performances from some of the boys so far. Uh, none better really than Burn. He's been an absolute revelation since coming into this side. Really, really good. Say seven assists in six games. Phenomenal. Hopefully we don't miss him too much. And this is the first game I'm going to play without playing the solid 11 that have played pretty much every single game. So this is quite a stressful uh, time for me. Hopefully we can continue to do the business though. Uh, Burn, in fact, shouldn't even really be on the bench. Yanchev can fill his spot. I definitely need to find a, a way of rotating this team slightly more. Um, some of these, these other players are make available for the second team so they can get that fitness uh, before next episode, I hope. But yeah, I've very, I've very much been caught up in the fact that I'm not losing. I'm winning every game. I'm, I'm winning every game, viewers. There's like this state of disbelief that I'm constantly in. I should run you through it, really. Uh, Kalasa will be in goal. Then Goni, Patti, uh, Ioannidis. Ioannidis. That's how you say it. That, why was that? that was a trouble yesterday. Uh, Lucas at left back. Lejeune Minas. There was a lovely moment there. Uh, Ludovic Kisa. Uh, the Pret. The, the Pret. Is that the Preti? The Preti probably. And Emmanuel up top who scored a few more goals. Not just in that first game against PSG. He's got a few more since then in the most recent games of course as well. Um, Klumeki. He's going to have a number as well. Jurgen Klopp's been on the phone. Are you, are you going to play him? Not, not at the moment, Jürgen, no. He's on the bench, though. So, you know, cheers, Jürgen. He's Barcelona manager. He's on loan from Barcelona. That's how it works. Uh, they're playing the exact same system as us. Of course, we're playing our former team, Nice, after this. Please keep the run going. I really hope the change of personnel here doesn't have any kind of ad adverse effect. We're about to find out. All right, we have been in scintillating form, and I'm hoping the boys can come in and just continue that, really, as I thought we were going to give the ball away. Immediately, viewers, as uh, Ludovic finds Emmanuel, who so far has been in 5-4. That is a very, very close effort. They just about clear it away a little bit hurriedly, it must be said. But that was quite exciting. They've had to do an early change as well. Uh, D'Antonio comes on for Prizo, which probably isn't good news for them, having to make a change so early. So, so far, 
so good. Happy. That's the, that's the overall feeling I've got right now. As uh, Lucas finds Lejeune. Lucas on it again. Plays the ball into the centre. Emmanuel was there. Akiza picks it up though. Goes for a goal himself. Blimey. Well, Byrne hasn't scored this year, Keith Byrne. Akiza is his first goal of the season in that role and scores immediately. Beautiful, beautiful goal. Let's take a look again in three dimensions. The, the home fans here absolutely loving that. Jo John Akiza, of course, a man from Valencia. The touch there, and then suddenly just, boof, just outside of the foot almost, sort of bends it into that corner. Beautiful strike, it really is. And it's a 1-0 lead, which is what we're looking for. I think going unbeaten this year, probably unlikely, but I mean... Seven. I mean, I say that. Bordeaux and Monaco haven't lost either, so this is not as impressive as I thought. It is impressive. No, no, give yourself the credit. This is very impressive, Ben. Come on, give yourself the credit. At half time, then, still a pretty relatively even game. I mean, we're dominating possession and we've got the goal, which is the most important thing. Pleased with how things are going. Keep it up. Everyone seems delighted. There's a real good feel good atmosphere at the moment. Um, not with the players that aren't playing, because some of those haven't been selected for the Europa League. Because I, it turns out, viewers, I don't have any French players, or not nearly enough. So January, I will be looking for, specifically, French brilliance. That's French brilliance, that's right. If there's a player called French brilliance, I want, it, I want him in my team. In fact, I might buy a player and just call him French brilliance. I can't rule it out, viewers. You, you know me. Ludovic's going to pick this up. He's struggling a little bit for fitness, but he's running at the back four anyway. Akiza knocks it on to Mahaz, who's been amazing. So good so far this season. Lucas Ball in as... Oh, God. Okay, that's not his best work. Uh, he's missed, viewers. We've all seen it. 15 minutes to go. Some of these guys are a little bit tired. Um, that said, I think bringing uh, Klumeki on... For Ludovic on that side, probably the move right now. Yanchev maybe in the centre. Um, Del Prete is having a pretty indifferent game. Yanchev can, can play out there. Yeah, why not? He can, he can play there. He's got all the attributes to play there as well. So we'll give it a whirl. Uh, Emmanuel, I guess, could have played there as well. We could have brought on a different striker. But anyway, still 1 0. Looking good. Happy. I'll take it. I'll take a little scraped 1 0. I'm not bothered. The unbeaten thing right now, I am loving viewers, honestly. <laughs> Don't. Well, actually. I mean, even if they score, they'll be unbeaten. But the idea, I like the green. I'm enjoying how much green there is. Don't do this now. Don't do this late in the game. I don't need it, viewers. Goni with a great challenge. They're not done yet. They've ball played in and... <laughs> We're fine. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna do, um, I was going to go defensive, but I'm actually going to keep it as is. I've done that in every game so far. And it's worked again. Didn't change anything. Got the result I wanted. 1-0. The streak continues. Will it be halted? I mean, it'd be quite poetic, wouldn't it? Will it be ho uh, halted by Nice? Nice so far this season having a lower mid-table finish, or, or I say seven games in, lower, lower mid-table season. Can we continue? 21 points or something that's going flipping well. All right, we're going to rest the boys that have played, keep them refreshed, keep them ready for action. Uh, and of course, hopefully, I mean, I'm going to put them in now and then hopefully they stay fit. Uh, Shelton comes back in as well. Uh, there was, was there another one? I feel like there was another one. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, there was. Uh, Right-sided midfielder. Ruiz comes back in as well. So let's hopefully see those boys fit. There's three days in between the two games. So we should, should be okay. Jan Pronk has asked me a question. I want to ask him a question. How do you, Yang Pronk? Love it. Love it very much. Uh, as, as we've got an intermission here, viewers, you may have noticed, uh, there is new... There's new colours around. I've yeah, I've had a I've had a rebrand. Um, I might make a video about sort of a little bit, a little bit of a lifey sort of. This is what's going on. Video. Also, uh, I promised it for years. I, I'm very very close. It'll probably be at the end of this week. A setup video, viewers. I know what a what a time to be alive. Obviously, you've seen the camera reposition and the quality and the lights look better. But I have I've got a new desk and oh, it's lovely. It's gone well. Hopefully, that's the sort of thing you'd like to see. Uh, would you like to see it? I'm asking. I'm asking now. Would you like to? All right. As we get closer, hopefully, I've just noticed Lille and Monaco play. But hopefully, we um we've got a fully fit side. Monaco have beaten Lille, so that's uh, that's a relatively big uh, result as they go top of the table. As if I've not lost a game and I'm not even top. I know, I know they've played a game more than me but even so that's madness and now i go away to nice <laughs> i just i've played this game so many times that i know that if there's one thing football manager love to do it's to ruin my afternoon with with this moment right here i can i can just feel it i've got a yeah there it all oh, is tangible viewers it's football isn't it it's written in that it's written in the stars a million miles away anyway um sorry yeah Col <laughs> colassa is gonna be in goal goni shouting boss 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 yeah shouting everything everything all right i think you're shouting t-shirt on boss uh oh no i've it's diego in it so is there a shouting t-shirt boss N well no there is there isn't a shout do you mm, no Oh, oh, oh. Just this, I just haven't got around to sorting one out yet. 
<laughs> yeah, but boss, this is an elaborate ploy where you now bring out the shaman t-shirt. <laughs> no. It actually isn't. Oh. Carry on doing the team. So, uh, uh, Adonis will be next to Shelton. We've got Lucas, Lejeune, Munoz, Burn, Lidl. I feel... Sh Shelton, is everything all right? <laughs> Emmanuel's up front. Let's go into the game. God. We'll... F we'll, f we'll, um, we'll... Yep. All right, and there's the knee side. Uh, you can... <laughs> I've just accidentally pressed space bar. Well, it's gone, viewers. It's just... It's like magic. So watching David Blaine do Football Manager. Unbelievable. My, 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 my left hand touched the space bar and um, it's gone now. I could have gone back, viewers, but I feel like we're beyond it now. Just quickly, uh, Utaka's in there. Amarilla, Yonic. Uh, they've got Uvarenko at the back as well. Uh, Pueto, who is a, a, a goalkeeper I bought in and thought it would be great. There's been a chance, viewers, I think. We've had a shot. All right, the question is, can we keep the run going this will be sensational i mentioned uh, the next game would be monaco i've decided to uh, again I, I think when you're on this sort of run you want to be able to show how the run is developing and so far it's going really well speaking of runs by the way ruiz a minute in 60 seconds viewers just over has been taken out and it is a penalty no need for var and i'm going to assume actually it's not a manual if it no it's but um, mahoz is taking it stepping up scores the penalty it's a it's a two minute we're, we're good we're, it's a two minute moment we don't need to see it in three dimensions. You've seen you've seen penalties on Football Manager before. I'm, co I'm confident of that. By the way, thank you for uh, for dropping your likes on yesterday's video, smashing it, viewers, smashing it. Do the same again today, please do, please do. I encourage you. Of course I do. Okay, five seconds of the half to go. After that, really early, I'm looking at the match. <laughs> oh, if I was an East manager, I'd be losing my mind, viewers. Uh, it's, it's pretty one sided. It's pr it's pretty one sided. Actually, you say things are going well. Keep it up. This tactic's really good. Now, Lucas has got a little bit of an injury. It's a, it's a potential thigh injury. The fact his conditioning's still at 80 makes me think that he's probably going to be fine. If it was down in like the low 60s or something, I'd have got him off by now. But we'll keep an eye on it. But he seems to be doing okay. Burn has come back into the side, by the way. 6.4. Um, Not brilliant, is it? I also then forgot to put a key to on the base. He's now up to a 6.8. The, 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 it's changed quickly. Now, they've got the ball over viewers. And I don't want to state the obvious. Oh, Troy Parrot plays for them, by the way. Yeah, really. Um... Ball played back to Parrot. Now, let's listen up. Now, that... <laughs> oh, it's just funny, isn't it? Let's just laugh at it. Let's just find it really... Fu Troy Parrot scored, viewers. It's their first shot on target of the game. It's their first shot of the game. It's a 93-year-old Troy Parrot. I know you're surprised that a real person still exists in the game. Uh, how old is he? I know you're curious by this. 35. That's him. Oh, he's brilliant, isn't he? He's really brilliant. He's really... D I'm sickened, viewers. I've gone positive because I'm obviously furious. And um, we'll go... We'll demand more. I mean, what more can I... Okay, we'll make a change. Chilmecki. I mean, Jürgen Klopp's been calling for it. Is this his big moment? Let's see if this is his big... It could be his big moment. Who knows? Ruiz is having a shocker. Janshev's going to come on at right mig. R right mig. Right mig, viewers. Right mid. I think that was the difference between midfield and big. Which, again, Janshev's got a tight groin. Am I really going to drop points if this came to this? I mean, what's, what do I change here? This, the bench is not... So Burn to come off? Yeah, sure. Burn's coming off. Zivkovic coming on. We're going to top, top viewers. There's, there's not really much option here. We'll go attacking. Sure you will. I mean, not like we've not... Because, you know, we're only dominating the game entirely. So now I feel the need to actually go attacking. I'm sick to the core, viewers. We'll demand more. Well, there's five minutes of our time. Are we going to continue our winning streak? We're going to we're going to go top of the table regardless. Oh, viewers, this is where magic can happen. Oh, I thought it was done. I was about to be completely furious. But now, with the Yanchev on the ball, we might have one final... That is, is that really the highlight? Is that really the highlight? Let me just find out. Hello, is that really the highlight? It, it is. See you later. That was actually the, unless, well, hang on, unless that wasn't, I might have to bring them back. Parrot's made a brilliant challenge. I don't know, I don't want to say, of course it's Nice. I, I talked about this, and then when we scored after two minutes, I thought, nah, yeah, well, I've been, you jinxed it in the, you, you did the reverse jinx, as it's known. And I thought, oh, I'll fix that for myself. It's going to be brilliantly. We've scored two minutes in. We're probably going to be like 6-0. It's going to be brilliant. And now that's happened, and I want, I want, to, I want to shout and scream, viewers. Troy Parrot, 35-year-old Troy Parrot. I'm not happy with the performance. I'm aggressively furious. Of course I am. Take your chances, boys. Yanchev's injured. Lucas is out for a few days with a bruised thigh. I don't care. I don't, I'm... Oof. Manager slams team. Weirdly, viewers, if you'd have said after eight games I'd have won seven and drawn one, I'd have been well happy with that. But because it's Nice and because of the... All right, whatever, viewers. Whatever. If you enjoyed today's video, if you want to see more, 
then subscribe and I'll see you soon. We love with care. If it's been until next until next time. It's all it's all yellow. See you soon. I'm <laughs> I'm fine with it. I'm absolutely fine with it.